Hello everyone, this is Jeff from Tau Flare Mouse. What we have here is a container of water. We also have a container of lead birdshot. And then finally we have a container of mercury. They're equal in volume, temperature, and pressure, but they differ in weight, and that difference in weight is called specific gravity. Specific gravity is the ratio of the density to, of a substance to the density of a reference substance, which is usually water, fresh water, which is the same weight throughout the world, right? Now water is our reference, so it's given the number one, has a specific gravity of one. If that was completely solid lead, it would have a specific gravity of 11.34, and the mercury has a specific gravity of 13.534, over 13 and a half times the weight of water. And it's always neat to really see things with your own eyes, seeing is believing, and we'll dump this three pounds of mercury into this glass. Uh, three pounds is equivalent to four 12 ounce cans of soda, just as a reference there. And we'll take a, uh, a 22 cartridge and see how it floats on there. You know, it's, it's the 22 cartridge is brass and lead, so it should, it should float because the specific gravity is less than mercury. And as you can see, it floats around like a cork and no matter what we do, it, nothing will make it sink. So this is a piece of tungsten carbide. It's used for machine work and uh, cutting tools and stuff like that. And it's a very, very dense and a very hard material. It's so hard, it'll scratch glass. And maybe you, you've thought that only diamonds can cut glass, but Tungsten carbide can do the same thing. In fact, it can cut a scratch into hardened steel. It's that hard. Not much can uh, damage a hardened steel file like that. Now we'll see if the tungsten carbide will float or sink in mercury. Now it's got a higher specific gravity, so it should sink. We set it on there and it floats. Why is that? Well, that's because of something called surface tension. And mercury has a very high surface tension. If we fidget around with it and drop it in there, then it sinks. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you very much for watching.